Hi, this is Dr. Tom, and again I'm talking about the use of HCG and hormone replacement in men. Uh, I had talked about primary hypogonadism and secondary hypogonadism, and of course there is tertiary hypogonadism, and usually this is due to different types of medications that can cause this. One of the things that has been implicated in, in tertiary hypogonadism is because of the loss of cholesterol. Cholesterol production is important in producing hormones, especially the androgens such as estrogen, testosterone, are just two examples of what comes from the cholesterol molecule. If men are taking drugs that inhibit the production of cholesterol, that is many of the cholesterol lowering drugs that we're using to combat things like atherosclerosis and heart disease, you can have a decrease in production of your testosterone, thus that is tertiary hypogonadism. The treatment is obviously would be to try to remove these type of substances and also to determine if you can increase testosterone production by again doing a challenge test as I have described before either with HCG or compounded you can use uh, clomiphene or um, uh, clomid to do a test for stimulation of men's ovaries to see if they have primary or secondary hypogonadism.